Hello again, everyone. My name is Valerie, and we are, and this is Tony. Oh my God, very important. This is Tony, saying hi to everybody here who's waiting to hear another Tony story today. So if you haven't met us already, um, Tony is a little turtle who sees and feels things a little bit differently. He's telling you here himself, am I doing all the talking? So he wants to tell you that if things get a bit noisy, right, he covers his ears, or he likes to, I tickle you there, he likes to go into his shell. Just like that. It makes him feel better if he's in his shell. If things are too bright, into his shell. If he doesn't like the touch of something, sometimes if he gets wet or something like that, he doesn't like the feeling. Or if there's paint on his hands, he doesn't like it. Oh, he doesn't like it. So he has to wash his hands really fast. Or it might go into his shell if he really doesn't like it. So we've doing lots of different stories about Tony and things that mom might do or dad might do to help him to overcome the different challenges that he has. Because he has to try really hard, Tony does, don't you, Tony? And he always tries hard and he always tries his best. And there's lots of things we can do to help Tony is we can talk a little bit slower. We can show pictures when we're telling him what we want it to do because the pictures will help him along with the word. Um, and we can keep our language nice and easy. And that really helps Tony because then he understands what's happening. So will we see how Tony gets on when he goes to a party. Oh, my goodness, look at this. Tony goes to a party. Now, I know it's been hard over COVID-19. We haven't gone to lots of parties, but we're starting to come back. Things are starting to open up again and hopefully soon we'll all be able to have lots of parties again. So will we start Tony Goes to a Party? And I am so happy and so is Tony to be reading the stories for Mead County Council Library Service. So thank you for asking us to read the stories and we're so happy to. So I'll put Tony down for a minute because he wants to listen too. He never gets sick of these stories. He hears them loads and he wants to listen again. So Tony goes to a party. Let's get the first page ready so everyone can see. Can you see here now? Tony wakes up and opens his eyes. He hears mummy calling. She has a surprise. Tony, Tony, look what came. It was in the post box and it has your name. <gasps> Tony's excited and he opens to see. It's a birthday invitation, mum, just for me. It's from Henry the Hare, his friend from next door. It's on next Friday and he's going to be party is on in a kids play zone where it's very noisy and balls are thrown. You see parties are not really Tony's thing especially when everyone starts to sing. Mum sees Tony begin to fret and says it'll be a great party Tony I just bet. You can always bring your special flashcard and use it whenever things get too hard can you see? He has a special key right here with different feeling faces on it. One has an angry face, one has a sad face, and one has a happy face. So he can let people know how he's feeling if he doesn't feel like talking. Then these help. Okay, just if he doesn't feel like talking. It can be hard for Tony to find the right word. So he might need some extra help if he wants to be heard. So the flashcards are there to give Tony a voice and they come to his aid when he's making a choice. So all these picture cards really, really help Tony. It's the day of the party and Tony's excited. Now that he is delighted that he was invited. They look at the day plan. Do you remember I told you about the day plan in the other stories? Maybe this is your first story so you might know. The, the day plan helps Tony feel really safe because he sees what's happening next in the day. So they look at the day plan and Tony is glad. First it's the party, then stories with dad. Can you see it here? So there's the party and then he comes home to have stories with dad. In the car, mum goes through each party rule. It will help at the party, just like in school. You must listen, share, and always play well and try your best to stay out of your shell. She smiles and says, don't forget the most important rule of all. The biggest rule of all is to have lots of fun. <gasps> she said, don't forget the last one. The important rule. 
is to have lots of fun. That's the best rule at a party, isn't it? To have loads of fun. Mum has filled Tony's yellow backpack with his special flashcards and a tasty food snack. She knows Tony's fussy about his food. What's to eat at the party might upset his mood. So Mum, Mum is prepared for the party. So she only puts in the yellow backpack of what Tony will like to eat. She also reminds Tony when he's walking around that he should never ever eat food from the ground. We all need to remember that some, don't we? Not to eat food from the ground. Tony knows eating from another table is not allowed to. He knows that. But, and Mum smiles to herself because she's feeling really proud. As Tony goes into the party. She's very proud of him because she knows it's hard for him. They arrive at the party right on time. And Tony sees Henry, who has started to climb. He anxiously looks over at Mum, but she smiles at him and puts up her thumb. She's saying, go on, Tony, you can do it. I know you can. Tony runs off to join his friends, climbing and moving around the bends. The children's play, play zone is like a maze with so much to explore in so many ways. Tony is having so much fun, he forgets all about the noise and he just wants to run. The candles are lit, it's time for some cake. So Tony makes a, de a decision here. He decides to go into his shell for a quiet break. So he just, he doesn't, I remember I told you already, he doesn't really like the singing part. So before he gets upset or anything, he just goes into his shell, which is no problem, goes into his shell. So he stays in there when they sing their song. He comes out when it's done. Oh, it didn't take long. See, back out again, because he just doesn't like everybody singing together. It hurts his ears. Again, that's something he'll get used to again, but he has to just, every time he gets more and more used to it. Then Tony asks to play hide and seek. Count to ten, Tony, and don't you peek. They have lots of fun playing Tony's game. Oh, he's now delighted that he came. It's Henry's turn to make a plan. And he says, let's play tag. Catch me if you can. But Tony does not want to play and he feels the urge to run away. What do you think is the matter with Tony? <gasps> I must turn the page properly. Tony thinks about what mom would say if she saw him pouting and refusing to play. So he's thinking of mom's voice now while he's at the party and mom would say, it's important Tony that everyone gets a turn. You know that this is something you have to learn. Just try a new game and you'd never know. You might just love it if you give it a go. So Tony was thinking about that and thinking, yeah, you know what? My mum is very clever. She knows what she's talking about. So Tony joins in and he tries very hard and he didn't need to use his special flashcards. They run and they jump into the balls and they stay in there until they hear their mum's calls. Tony really doesn't want to get out and he tries really hard not to pout. He tells his mum about all the fun and says, oh, I wish it wasn't all done. But mum reminds Tony of his day plan. You've been to the party, so now you can. He thinks for a while, then he stops looking sad. It's time to go home and have stories with dad. Yay, that was on his day plan. Do you remember at the start? Tony says, thank you, Henry. That really was great. Now it's time to go home before it gets too late. When they get home, Tony checks the day plan. Can he have his stories with dad now? Yes, he can. Because he can always have what's on the day plan. So whatever mom or dad put on the day plan. So first he has to do one thing. And then after that, he gets the thing that he wants to do the most. So he's I had to, went to the party and he tried very hard. And now it's time for him to come home and relax with dad and listen to some stories. Just like he had been listening to these Tony stories. And I hope you enjoyed this one. It's one of my favorites, Tony going to a party. So thank you all for listening again. And I'll be back soon with another Tony story. Bye bye everyone. Mm -hmm.